Hey, what is up you guys? Welcome to or welcome back to my channel. My name is Josh and I'm a makeup artist from New York. I have a brand new video for you guys today. What is going on you guys? What's up? What's been going on in your life? How are you guys? How are you feeling? A lot's been going on recently and the climate's um, very tense. I hope you guys are all safe and everything at home. Um, I just want to say that I hope everybody knows that I 100% support everything that's going on right now um, as in the Black Lives Matter movement. I don't know why I love As in the Black Lives Matter movement and any money I make from affiliate codes for the month of June will be going to the George Floyd Memorial Fund. His uh, The link to that fund will also be in the description down below. Um, make sure you guys sign the petition, make sure you guys donate and make sure you guys do everything you can to make your voices heard because we can't go silence you know but um anyways let's get right into this video today we are doing a full face of kim chic beauty so if you guys want to see what i think about the makeup make sure to keep on watching <laughs> Make sure you guys leave a comment down below what you think about this video and make sure you guys hit that thumbs up button for that YouTube algorithm and don't forget to hit that subscribe button if you aren't subscribed to my channel already. About 85% of you aren't subscribed so please make sure you guys hit that button and of course make sure you hit that post notification icon so you are notified every single time I drop a brand new video. I drop videos Monday, Wednesdays and Fridays so make sure you guys stay tuned. But yeah let's get right into it. So I have a bunch of products I picked up from Kim Chic Beauty. This is Kim Chi, if you guys don't know who she is. She is a drag queen from RuPaul's Drag Race Season 8. I'll insert a picture right here. <laughs> and funny clips. Oh, I came to chop through the competition. My name is Kim Chi, and I came here to destroy everyone with my makeup. I'm known for a crazy over the top pure anime fantasy. Kim Chi! Congratulations, you're the winner of this week's challenge. Yay! <laughs> 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 Who knew that was lurking underneath <laughs> that? We all knew. We all knew. <laughs> Holy I'm fine, I'm fine. Classic kimchi. When you thought it was all just a dream, it will come true for you because life will get better. I am proving to myself, to the world, and my mother that all the work and all the crazy stuff I've been doing for all these years has not been a waste. I have never, ever wanted anything more. I want this so bad, it hurts. I don't want to be America's Next Drug Superstar. I am America's Next Drug Superstar. And yeah, it just says, hey darling, you're going to destroy everyone with your kill-up makeup looks. And now, in the embodiment of kimchi, I have a lisp as well. <laughs> so, first, before I go into any of the products, I am going to prime my face. Because not to prime is a crime, just like Nikki says, we already know. So, we're going to go in with the Bobbi Brown Enriched Vitamin Face Base. Now, I'm just going to prime my eyes with the MAC Painterly Paint Pot. Now that I've primed my face and primed my eyelids, we're going to go into the first product from Kim Cheek Beauty. So, first up, we have the Kim She Chic, Kim She Chic X Catnips Presenting Rainbow Shards. And this is their first eyeshadow palette. Look at this packaging. It's so awesome. It's so iconic. I love the catnips on it. And this is what the back looks like right here. The brand is a vegan as well as cruelty free. Oh wait, I don't know if it's vegan. The brand is cruelty free. I don't think it is vegan. But this has eyeshadows and pressed pigments. And this retails for I believe like $38 or $42. I'm not completely sure. Oh my god, look at the packaging. This is so nice. So it has a little cartoon snippet on here. If you guys want, you can pause it to read it. This is so cute. And on the back too, it just has more art. Haha, <laughs> I've never seen anything like this. All right, so let's open this up. Oh, wow. Ooh. Let's take off the plastic protector. Here's the color story of the palette. It reminds me of the, take a look at the Amrezi color story. Ready? Look at that. And now look at this color story. 
Very similar. I like it. So we have a bunch of neutral tones and a lot of shimmers and some blues and some pinks. Um, it's really, you can say, a perfect palette for a drag queen because this is a lot of colors they need, neutrals and shit, to buff it and build. But, um, yeah, let's go in. So I'm going to go in with the Scott Barnes number 62 brush, and I'm going to go in with the burgundy shade. So far the pigment is really nice, it's present, I barely touched the color and the pigment is already coming off really really nice. I'm already really impressed. Okay, the pigment really said hello, I am here. It is not playing around. I really like how this color is looking on my skin tone, it's looking really nice. So now I'm just going to take the shade natural and I'm going to put that on my, actually I'm going to take the shade organza and I'm going to put that on my brow bone. And that just helped me buff out the color right there. So I'm just going to go back in with the burgundy. I'm seriously impressed with this palette right now. So now I'm going to dip into the shade chocolate and I'm just going to deepen that up a bit. Do you guys see this? This is like the perfect nude. Like, what the heck? <laughs> I'm really loving this nude palette. I'm really liking how that's looking. So now I'm going to go in with my finger and I'm going to dip into the shade Rich. I'm really liking how that's looking. Now I'm going to go in with the Morphe 321 and I'm going to dip into the shade Champs. And I'm going to put that in the inner corner. I'm really loving this like reddish brick color look. It's looking really nice. So I'm going to finish off the other eye off camera. And then we're gonna finish off the look. So this is a completed eye look. The vampire in me really jumped out. I don't know what happened. <laughs> Apparently, I don't know what season it is. <laughs> All right, so honestly, yo, those shadows, I'm freaking impressed. For a palette, for, for a brand's first palette, to be fair, Kimchi knows her shit. So are we really surprised? <laughs> Anyways. Next, now that I've done my eyes, we are going to go in with some foundation. So I'm going to go in with the Bobbi Brown Skin Long Wear Weightless Foundation. It seriously should be illegal how freaking nice this foundation is. Every time I put it on, I'm still shook. Anyways, next product from Kim Chic Beauty. We are going into the brand new, the most concealer. Conceal, cover, correct, and contour. The most concealer is the Multitasker Superstar. And this, I believe, comes in over 20 something shades, like 26 or something like that. I got the shade TMC09 Deep Sand. And this is what the component looks like. A lot of people were commenting that they did not like how the component nor how the applicator looked because it is one of these applicators in my opinion for the fact that it's a starting off brand i'm very impressed with the fact that she even came out with a concealer so early um if you, many of you know i'm working on my own brand i'm not gonna lie and concealer is definitely not one of the first things we are considering because this is very difficult so i'm very very amazed so we're gonna try this out um I'm pretty good with matching myself with just my eyes, so we're gonna hope this is my color. <laughs> so I believe you just squeeze and apply where it's needed. So let's see. Ready? Do we see any product? I don't see anything. Oh, it's coming, it's coming, it's coming. It's coming, I see it. It's, oh, there it is. <laughs> let's try this out. 
Whoa, the formula is really thick. Really, really thick. I like it. Okay, so I don't hate the application. It was pretty seamless. And it's really good, the formula, so far, like how it feels. So let's buff it on and see what I think. Whoa, it has a lot of coverage. Wow, I think this thing just covered my student debt. This thing has so much coverage. To anyone trying this out for the first time, a little goes a really long way. <laughs> okay, so that concealer is in the name. Definitely the most. <laughs> I'm freaking highlighted for the gods right now. Yeah, you heard it here first. Um, I... I approve this concealer. It is full coverage as hell. <laughs> Continuing with the look, I don't tend to do this too much, but since it is a dry queen brand and we are reviewing the products, I decided to pick up the Kimchi Chic Puff Puff Pass setting powder, and I picked mine up in the shade Suntan. So that's the fifth darkest shade. And yeah, um, this is gonna be different. So I don't really recommend setting powder for every day because you don't really need it. But dry queens, they need it because they're gonna set their makeup for the whole night. So this thing, I is I know this is gonna be heavy duty. Oh my god! Like, can we just talk about the packaging? Like, all this packaging is so freaking cute. Look at this. Look at the yellow. Look at the donut. Let's open this. It's not a scratch and sniff. Make these scratch and sniff country beauty. Thank you. Ooh, I love it. Ooh, it's a soft matte touch. It feels so nice and it looks so nice. Let's open this up. Oh, and there's a thingy in here to beat my face. We about to beat my face drag queen style today, baby. Let's do it. Oh. It's so soft. Oh my god, so many hairs are coming off of it. Let me just... Yeah. These shed, like, when you get it at first. So, let's just uh, give it a little. Alright, so we're going to take off the protector. Oh, and it comes in the shape of a heart. So cute. How does she get all these things done? <laughs> the packaging's complicated. <laughs> Woo! Got it. Let's get this bitch in here. So we're just gonna put some into this little container and I'm gonna use a puff to beat my face. I went in very lightly as I did not know what to expect from the powder. Now I'm gonna go in with the Scott Barnes number 67 brush and just take off all that powder. It's exactly as I was expecting, very heavy duty. I feel dry as hell, but like, she ain't moving though. It's nice, it didn't give me too much attention in the areas that I don't want it. It did lighten me a lot, it did ghost me a little, so let's bring some life back into me, shall we? I just realized that while puffing my face, I ruined my under eye for the eyeshadow. But it's okay, we're just gonna leave it like that. Continuing, we are going to go into the Kim Chi Chic Stage Proof Matte Setting Powder. This is what this looks like. Oh my god, look at the bottle, it's so cute. It's a mint green. Let's spread the face down. It smells like vodka. <laughs> I would say that helped me bring me back to life a bit. Besides my rough under eyes. Let's buff that out since we're here. So I'm gonna take a Scott Barnes number 63 brush and I'm gonna go back in with the kimchi palette. And I'm just going to take that chocolate shade again. And I'm just gonna buff that into the under eye. This is me trying to fix this look. I just made it more grunge. <laughs> I think we're just gonna have to rep the grunge. We're just gonna fully have to just rep the grunge. Okay, so I just added a few studs, fixed up the under eye, made it look a little nice. So now we're going to go back into the palette because you know it's a drag queen palette. So you know we're about to bronze with this bitch. I'm actually going to take my Morphe E4 brush and I'm going to dip into Toast and use that to 
warm up my edges. And this is why I love how useful dry queen palettes are because you could take this and do a full face. I'm not gonna lie. I like how the look is coming along together so far. It's looking pretty nice. But you know what we do need? We need some highlighter. Let's go in with the Kim Chic Beauty Drama Queen. Oh, it's upside down. Oh, no, it's not. Drama Queen Highlighter Palette. And this has six shades. Spread like butter, smooth as silk, cinnamon glaze, golden queen, flush doll, and green with envy. This is what the palette looks like. And let's see those pans in there. Whoa. These are some... Oh, they're too bright. There you go. Ooh, wow. I think we're going to go in with this one in the bottom right corner. And I'm going to go in with my Scott Barnes number 66 brush. Ooh, oh, these are not playing. <laughs> All right, all right, all right. Do you? <laughs> I'm fucking weak. Okay, maybe this time I went in with a little too much. This shit's blinding as hell. Oh, wow. To tell you I'm freaking impressed with this brand is an understatement. The formula is insanely smooth and soft and supple. <laughs> I'm just, I'm blown away with, with every single thing in this collection. All right, so next product we're going in is the Holographic Toppers for eyes, cheeks, lips, and body. And this is, of course, from Kim Chic Beauty. This looks beautiful. And I think we're just going to use this a little on the eyes, and then we're going to do some on the high point of the cheekbone. So I'm gonna go in with my finger into the shade. Oh wait, check it out first. <laughs> These are the shades. So we got four, we got thunder, ice, hail, and storm. I'm gonna go in with storm and I'm just gonna top my lid with that. Oh my God, oh my freaking God. Holy shit. Oh my God. Look. This is a holographic, and this is no holographic. Hoo -hoo. Oh my god. <laughs> well, the topper is now all over the left side of my cheek, as I did not notice that it was falling. It's okay. We're just gonna blow from everywhere. <laughs> oh wow, that just turned the eyes from zero to a million. That's crazy. I'm gonna go in with ice, and I'm gonna put that in my inner corner. Oh my god who allowed me to have this <laughs> this is the worst thing you could give me i'm gonna put it everywhere and i'm just gonna top off the high points of the cheekbone with a little bit of ice as well now i know why she always looks so goddamn good with these Ooh, wow, I cannot stop staring at myself. I'm shook. All right, we're getting almost done here. Next, this isn't really a product I can use, but I'm going to show it to you guys because it's so freaking cute. But she has these... <laughs> she has these little gummy bear sharpeners, and they just say Kim Chic on it, and it's the cutest thing ever. And like, yeah, who doesn't need a pencil sharpener, you know? But the last product we're going into is the Kim Chic Gloss Over Gloss. And this is what it looks like in some cute pink packaging with kimchi on it. Oops, sorry. With kimchi on it. And we this is the shade Peach Shimmer. And yeah. This is what the component looks like right here. It's so cute. It's a pink handle. And it just says Gloss Over Gloss, Kim Chic. And we're just going to go in. Oh, wh holy crap. None of these reactions are fake either. Like, this is all so genuine. I'm, I'm astonished. I'm so excited for what else this brand's going to come out with. Oh, my freaking God. 
do you guys see this look like I'm, I'm speechless <laughs> I have nothing to say this is a small owned indie brand and like it's amazing I, I have no words I'm a loss um, everything that I tried today is definitely approved from me you guys should definitely go check out this brand I'm gonna leave the link in the description down below they're small business so definitely in a time like this you want to know where your money's going you know but the palette pigmented the powder powerful the setting spray smell like vodka but it set everything down the gloss so moisturizing and so reflective <laughs> the highlighter was like butter and those toppers were I'm you guys have to go try this out for yourself. I hope you guys enjoyed this one. <laughs> Make sure you guys check out Think of the Podcast. My podcast is a brand new episode every single week. The link will be in the description down below. And make sure you guys check out Think of the Merch. The Merch for the podcast. It will be launching in around a week and a half. We are right around launch. Make sure you guys are following our Instagram for the giveaways that are coming soon. And to get 20% off your first purchase. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace.